on February 14, 2024, one of the world's largest elections in a single day will take place in Indonesia. Over 200,000 eligible voters out of a total population of nearly 280 million people will head to the polls to cast their votes for representatives at all government levels in the executive and legislative branches. In the spotlight, however, is the race for the offices of the president and vice president, since Indonesia's current president, Joko Widodo, better known as Jokowi, is term limited. Three pairs of candidates are vying for the country's top jobs. First is Anis Baswedan, former governor of Jakarta and former minister of culture and education. His running mate is Mohaimin Iskandar, chairman of the National Awakening Party. Second is current defense minister Prabowo Subianto and his running mate, Gibran Rakabuming Raka, mayor of Surakarta in central Java, and rather controversially, President Jokowi's eldest son. Third is Ganjar Pranowo, former governor of central Java, and his running mate, Mahfoud MD, who is a current coordinating minister for politics, legal, and security affairs. Although there will be a significant change of personalities at the highest levels, depending on who wins, there may well instead be a continuation of old-style politics and players. One of the biggest issues in this election is Jokowi's overall influence and what that means for the future of democratic politics in Indonesia. Ultimately, February 14 might not be the be-all and end-all for Indonesia's elections. If there is no clear majority vote for any one ticket, the country will go to a second round of voting in June for the two candidates with the most votes. So, stay tuned.